welcome to the first of my revision videos for the Development Dilemmas Unit. First of all, what is development? Well, development is the economic and social progress that leads to an improvement in the quality of life for an increasing percentage of a population in a particular place. When we're thinking about development, we often think about a country's development. We tend to put countries into two brackets. MEDCs, which are more economically developed countries, tend to be richer, generally people have a higher standard of living and work in our tertiary and quaternary industries, therefore earning more money and having a better quality of life. At the other end of the scale we have LEDCs, less economically developed countries, countries where people tend to be a lot poorer, people generally work in primary industries, some secondary industries and therefore earn less. Low paid jobs equals lower standard of living. Now, on a global level, we have a pattern emerging. We have our more economically developed countries, mainly in the Northern Hemisphere. Uh, our exception is Australia and New Zealand, and our less economically developed countries, which are in our Southern Hemisphere, South America, Africa, Asia. However, this pattern is far too simplistic, and what we need to recognize is that within regions, so for example, within Africa, but also within countries, it's a lot more diverse and we have a disparity or a great difference emerging. Within places, we have a core region and a periphery. The core regions tend to be our urban areas, they're richer, and our periphery regions tend to be our rural areas, which are poorer. 